Hi guys and welcome to a new doll box opening and review video. Today I have with me the little princess Nina who has her own particular story. But first thing first, I would like to thank all my old subscribers for sticking around for so long and all the new ones who came over the past few days. Like that's amazing guys, like re really, I really appreciate that. And if you haven't subscribed yet and you already came here before, please subscribe because you know you'll be back. And if it's your first time, uh, you're here to stay, trust me. So please subscribe. Anyway, so this doll is probably the doll who haunted me the most in the short time she was out. So this is Little Princess Nina. And she is the second Little Princess Nina, and she is a limited Amazon store doll. So let's open her and see her from close up. So here is Little Nina that I miraculously managed to get. I don't know why she didn't sell out super fast because the other one did. So I have no idea what happened with her. Maybe other people got annoyed like I did. But anyway, she's here, and there is no denying that she's super cute. So. So you can see her, her, her picture here and you have like with the outfit here and she has this little sort of bag and here you can see and at the back you have the picture with her coat so she's come with this fluffy winter outfit like it's fluffy at the color and she has like earmuffs as well And she has this sort of like it's like a royalty tapestry here on the wall of this room. She has like kind of old fashioned uh, horse and lamp here, and she has a bookshelf on the other side and a painting here. So she has kind of a cute little background. So let's have a look at the book. So she even has her own book, I guess. So you have her on the front cover with her long hair. And the thing is, she came out with her maid, and the maid of the first one has short hair, like the first one. And the maid of this one has the longer hair, but the maid came out like way before. So as you can see here, you have both of them, so long hair for both of them. Little maid she saw. And little princess Nina so she comes with this bag oh, that's the book because the book and the bag look kind of the same so this is the book of the maid who is going to tell stories to the little princess and so you have like the story written here I should I should have I should actually tell you the stories uh, I'll probably do that sometime later like I plan on doing that but I never went through that so and you have like a picture of both of them and like they look super adorable with long hair like they were good with short hair but the longer version couple thing is kind of pretty nice and so you have like picture with all her characteristics and everything she comes with so the earmuff the coat bag dress um, like sh sh shirt socks like underwear of doll and basically if you remove the dress and put only those two it looks like she's in pajama so it's pretty nice and like extra pair of hand and shoes and basically that's it so now let's have a look at everything she comes with first so the earmuffs So it's like a bow uh, in like Bordeaux color with less and it's like mounted on this sort of wired cover, like plastic covered black with a black fabric thing and it has a fluffy here piece. Then she has a coat. So her coat is like blue and it has some design on it. Wow. Huh. 
so much tape everywhere. So here is a coat. So basically it doesn't have sleeves but it has holes for the hands and little color like same fluffy. Then she comes with shoes. I think those are kind of like old fashioned shoes really. It's like black, it has a sort of little thing cut here and it has sole all the feet in beige. It's like brown shoes. And then the extra hands are here. So I'm gonna change the hands because I like the normal hands. Those are called normal hands. I like the normal hands better than the open hands like hello open hands. So here. I'm gonna change that before I zoom on her. And we have the bag and it's like black huh it's a brownish black color it's more no it's the same it's just a light make it look black but it's kind of brown and it has like it looks like a sort of i don't know what it looks like it looks like a chair or a trailer i don't know and you have a moon on the other side and it has a chain and you can open here to put her it around the door and of course we're going to have a look at the doll freedom time Ta -da! Ta -da 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 -da. so finally she's out of the box she's home and everybody's happy so she can be with her friends I think they missed her she has like super cool hair like it's it's pretty nice and it's like soft and long and wavy I like that and she has nice blue eyes and yeah she's really cute and she has like the same dress as the other one except it falls properly because she was not sitting like the other one Anyway guys, I'm going to zoom on her and show her to you from close up. So guys, here is our little princess. So you can, I don't know, let's start at the top. So she has this big bow. It's like a bordeaux reddish style. Like it has like two. So the, the bow piece and the knot piece. And then you have less on each side. And you have this plastic covered with black fabric and the fluffy earmuffs and like it's black as a like on the inside and it stays really well on her head because that plastic thing is like just you spread it a little bit and then it just stick around so it's just well done then she has like long sort of brown blondish golden hair it's kind of a uniform style of color, but since it's wavy, you can see like it kind of takes the light very differently in different areas. So it it looks pretty nice. And she has bang and long hair basically, so the hair goes under her ass. And the thing is, she's a princess, but she doesn't have a princess cut. So it's just like normally long on each side. So it's a nice change compared to all the princess cuts that we have with Azon. Then she has pretty nice blue eyes, so it's kind of purplish uh, at the center top. Then you have this little black dot, and it's like light blue at the bottom with a white line going through. And a few little white dots. And she has some pinkish blush on her cheeks, and a normal little smile. Then she comes with, so she has this shirt, which is white, it has a big color with a decorative sort of ribbon on the around, on both sides. And you have like some lace and a little stone at the center. 
and she has like long sleeves and you can see the decorative lace here and she has some sort of design at the wrist then she also comes with this bag so you have the chain that I showed you earlier and you have this sort of design at the front which I don't know what it is either it's like a like box with stuff coming out or it's a chair I don't know it has a moon on the other side and it's kind of a golden copper cover and you can open it with a click button so you can put little thing inside you have like a different fabric in brown on the inside and the main piece of the bag is white and you can put stuff there and it's attached to a chain, golden chain which you can detach as I showed you earlier then she has this dress so it's like a long dress with this ribbon around her here with this little black bow she has decorative brown at the center with little buttons like fake little buttons and she has some embroidery on each side of the dress and she has some embroidery all around as well like those square rich size thing diamond shaped thing are not in the middle but the the line at the bottom is and she comes with this uh, underwear for doll which are generally like looks like pants shorts trousers so it's like white but it's a little bit transparent so you can kind of see the color of her skin through and you have like it's folded on several places and maintained with like thread and you have decorative lace as well and she has some woolly sort of socks in white which are also a little bit transparent and those little shoes with those ports here on the top and the beige sole of the feet thingy and basically that's it and she also of course has this coat so uh, that's the same sort of fluffy thing as the earmuffs and you have the second sort of fabric at the back like all around to make it pretty nice you have this blue fabric here on the outside and you have a second type of blue fabric on the inside so it's like double fabric you have a ribbon all around at the bottom and you have fake little buttons here and of course you have holes for the arms to go through on each side so basically if she wears it uh, you put the arms in the holes and it looks like this so I think it's kind of cute I mean you, you're going to see like better because I'm gonna close it up on the pictures so you're gonna see that better anyway this is little Nina. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about this doll. Uh, do you think it was a good idea to have both of them or do you think I should have just get only one and that's it? So now that I have like twins, I think this one is still the older sister because she, oh my god, see she was sitting so her dress is a little bit messy. Maybe I should iron it later. Anyway, so let me know what you think about this doll. Uh, I think I'm not 100% sure but this one is more blushed or maybe I thought the skin color was a bit different but it looks like the older version is a little bit more blushed than the new version so anyway you're going to see them next to each other on the pictures uh, don't forget so to leave me your thumb up and the comment in the comment section below and to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and see you next time for something else have fun whatever you do Bye!